We're filming this at a 5 p.m. So that's, I don't know how the lighting is gonna look how washed out. Sun sets over there, so I don't know why it's so sunny over here. Anyways, Pride Month, happy Pride Month. Big supporter of the LGBTQIA plus community, all that jazz, ally supporter. I like to decorate the cactus for things going on. The Dollar Tree, I don't know if they don't have out their Pride stuff yet. They already got 4th of July stuff out, we're a month away. And they had a lot, a lot of beach stuff. A lot of beach decor, like summers and smiles and suntan lotion and mojitos, margaritas, and yamamas. Left booty cheek on the sand. I don't know. I buy. I got the rainbow. What's this called? Oh, it's a rainbow. I got the rainbow. Rainbow. Hello. How's it going? Filming a YouTube video. Oh, well, I can hide back or not. Okay, I just got stuck. Not stuck on a phone call, but I was just FaceTiming, and now she's texting me. <laughs> oh my god, she looked so cute. Ugh, oh, they looked so cute. She went to uh, Taylor Swift's concert in Chicago. I was like, send me pictures. Tell me all about it. Best part, worst part, the special songs. I had to hear all about it. <laughs> She always fills me in on the Taylor Swift stuff. We're doing a P.O. box opening. What was I talking about earlier? We're doing a P.O. box opening. I was gonna do another video, but my anxiety's through the roof. So I was like, let me just stand in the office, do what I do best, talk out my booty. Just talk. That's that's what I do. And I do have packages sitting over here. As soon as I picked this one out of the mailbox, I was like, well, we, we have to do a P.O. box opening. Open on camera, please. Christine's late birthday gift. I'm sorry it's late. Lorena from Elgin, Illinois. This, this was in the back of the post office. I had a note in my post office box and it was like, hey, the package, the package that I'm trying to get to you, too big. So the, you just come to the desk. She goes in the back. I have my back turned. All I hear is this. Okay. And she puts it on the desk and she's like, okay, here it is. Oh my God, thank you so much. Yeah, that wouldn't have fit in the box. My box is about this big. <laughs> okay, I already see the paper. Oh my gosh. Oh, love the color. What does this say? She, she put the note on top. So I'm assuming we re read the note first. I open the packages in the order that they are opened. This, this box contains a lot of random shit. It's a late ass birthday gift to you. I will also never forget your birthday because my husband's birthday is the 21st of May and it's just backwards because I'm May 12th. There you go. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this late birthday gift. <laughs> I love that your husband now has to deal with my birthday as well. He's like, well, mine's on the 21st. And she's like, but Christine's on the 12th. And he's like, who's that? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, la, da, da. can I get an H, an A, a P, P, Y? Can I get a B, I, R, T, H, D, A, Y? That's a Happy birthday. Oh, it's a pride, pride birthday. <laughs> a little pinata, a little pinata. Look at that. Oh, perfect for pride. A little pride cactus. Yeah, I didn't need to go shopping. I'm just getting stuff out the mail. Is this a late birthday gift or a cactus decorating DIY kit? Oh, and you said random stuff. You weren't joking. Pom poms. Love it. Could always use pom poms. I got a craft bin, especially for that. What are these? Ornaments. Nightmare Before Christmas. Ornaments? Okay. I don't even know where you bought that. That might have been at your house in your garage sale pile. That might have been a gift for your husband. He said, you know, I'm not really not in the movies anymore. She said, throw it in the box. It's going to Christine's house. Kellogg's All Together Chapsticks? Lip flavored lip balm? Shut up. Look at that. Well, not shut up, but <laughs> Kellogg's Lip Balms? All of my lip balms. Lip glosses are uh, melting in my car. I had to clean out my middle console today because my Vaseline got up to 90 degrees, tipped over hot Vaseline in my console. Which one should we try? I'll save it for a TikTok. That might be fun. Little mini wheats lip gloss just tastes like grain on your lips. That's, I don't know if that would be good. There's like little flakes of frosted flakes in the, in the lip gloss. Frosted flakes, Apple Jacks, Rice Krispies, Corn Flakes, Raisin Bran lip gloss. You give some a big smooch on the lips. Like you taste like you just rolled out a bingo. Ketchup flavored lip gloss and keychain. Ketchup lip gloss, and then you can look, put it in the back. It's a travel lip gloss case. Listen, I, I love ranch. I'm from the Midwest. I love ranch. Um, ketchup? Oh, if you put ketchup on something, and I was like, oh, I didn't ask for ketchup, but I'll eat it. Mustard, I don't feel the same. Coming home from the bar. Ooh, the camera just stopped filming because it said the card was full. That's a 128 gig card. That's a lot of filming. Like I was saying, mustard, don't like it, but I'll still eat it. If you handed me some of the mustard on it, and you're like, oh, I just put everything on there because I just didn't know what you like. Okay, I'll still eat it. Mustard, won't really tolerate. Ketchup, tolerate, kind of like it. Ranch, love it. Splash on. Mayo, Hellman's brand, you know what I'm talking about? Mayo, not mayonnaise. I'll eat that. Just so we're all clear where my condiment allies lie. Oh my God, it just, it's weird in a lip gloss form. It's weird in a solid form. I think it's just cherry rather than ketchup. And it tastes like nothing. Fun! <laughs> There's a, oh, more lip gloss! Look at that. Sour Patch Kids lip gloss? Oh, for the love. Oh my God, it smells sour. <laughs> you know when you get something sour near you and your lips start to pucker and like 
Is that a warhead? You got a warhead in your pocket? That's, I could smell the sourness. Ooh, this smells good. It's making my eyes pop. Look, I'm putting a blue raspberry on top of a ketchup lip gloss. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. My mouth is watering. This one smells fantastic. Again, tastes like nothing. Ooh, that smells great. But don't mind me, I'm just smelling my lip. Me in a job interview, I'm just like. <laughs> like, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm just smelling my upper lip. Just smelling it, just keeping it flavorful up here. Men have a flavor saver as a mustache and I just have flavorful lips. <laughs> Put that on my Tinder profile. What is this? Markers? My daughter opened this too. I only used these once and thought you could use them. Illustration markers with the broad tip. <gasps> short tip? Oh, I do like markers. Broad tip, short tip. There's a girl on TikTok who like does this for a living. I love a good cream, clean, crisp marker. I have artsy friends that could use these, but also I, I use these as like a highlighter in a sense. Sunglasses? Look at these. Pop these bad boys on. Oh, it's purple. And now it's really dark. Hold on. Is this the star is born? Is this Hamilton? Born and raised. Texas. Oh, hey. I'm gonna go in the grocery store. They're like, well, how do you feel about barbecue? Born and raised in Texas. I'm like, I, it's good. I I like ranch. More glasses. Look at these bad boys. A little blue. Oh, look at the little splatter pink. <gasps> Cactus alloy. <gasps> Signed it. Great. Look at that. Oh my God, I'm wearing splatter paint today. I love seeing how other people splatter paint because I know how I splatter paint. I use acrylic, you know, paints on outdoor things. This... I like the color you use. The purple is a nice purple. Did you paint the canvas black? You did. Oh, these are just scrapbooking sheets. Love that little Irish, the little that. My mom used to be a really big scrapbooker. She scrapbooked like the first 18 years of my life. So we have a bunch of these scrapbook sheets. We don't have a lot of these. I have some of this. What is this, a scrub? Papaya, paradise, sea sugar scrub. What am I scrubbing? I also can't. Oh, wait, put that on your lips. Put that on your lips. That'll scrub the shit out of them. Put all over your body in circular motions in the shower. Put all over your body in circular motion. You think that would be enough directions? I need a little more detail. Counterclockwise, clockwise. Are we rinsing it off? Are we putting it on? What part of the bath are we doing this in? A cactus decor? Oh, a little mini cactus. Shut up. Is this the jacket that I'm wearing? <laughs> oh, it's close. It's literally the same print. <laughs> is this a big onesie? Or no, is this what I got in the last one too? I think it's another set of the pajamas with, oh, I didn't know it was the same print. We got another note. He put a note at the bottom and the top of the book. Hi, Christina, I've been following you since the beginning. You make me laugh so hard. You definitely and truly have a gift. I thought you said, I thought it said you travel well. I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> I cannot put into words what you've done for me over the past couple of years. You've gotten me through the sad days, the very dark days, have enough energy days, and everything in between. I don't think you realize how much joy and comfort you bring us. Your viewer is funny is an understatement when it comes to describing you. That's so nice. Please, please don't ever change because being you is what this world needs. You have a special gift in my heart. Special place in my heart. <laughs> as, for the, as for the big ass box. Okay, for the canvas, the raccoon is holding chapstick. If there was any could be holding chat, the raccoon is holding chapstick. That's cut back to that. I didn't even know it was a raccoon. I was just looking at the cactus. <laughs> Lastly, I just needed to thank you for being you. Uh, Lorena. Holy shit. Happy bladed birthday. I almost forgot. Ha ha. I'm done. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much for the package. Oh, I love a bunch of random stuff. So I'm going to do those chapstick try on, a cha chapstick try on haul, if you will. That'll be a fun TikTok. I feel like I got like 95 layers of chapstick on. It's just a lot. A lot of smells. Thank you so much for the package. I really appreciate it. This is from Belinda from Poway, California. Belinda. Wasn't Belinda the name of a witch in a TV show? What was her name Belinda? Just says thank you on it. <laughs> Is that something I said? Oh my goodness. Wait, do so, you just get stickers made of things that I've said? Christine, your friend Lily here. <gasps> from Lily. Okay, so Lily must have gotten an Etsy shop. Uh, here are some of my favorite sayings from your videos recently in sticker form. Love everything you do. She literally took some of my past sayings and made them in a sticker form. Ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that in a TikTok or a YouTube? Ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. You know, the way that my brain works, that is the that is the order it would come out. I come running up the driveway. I swing open the front door. You're eating dinner, sitting down, watching the Wheel of Forge. And I'm like, oh, no! <gasps> ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. Ask me what happened a little bit a while ago while I was in town. You won't believe it. I'll tell you what happened. If you sit down, you got another plate. Okay, what are you watching the Wheel of Fortune? The answer's going to be down by the bay. Anyways, ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. Ask me who I ran into a little bit a while ago. Richard, what a dick. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. 1,065-4. I think that's from the taco, the taco coffee run. 1,065-4 is how I pronounce my numbers. I need chapstick. Well, we got it now. I need chapstick. This is the motto for my life. I need chapstick. I need a thousand of these stickers. That's great. Let's go on a coffee run. 
I love that softball super fan. Because I always go to my friend's softball games. I love that. Lily, thank you so much. What a great gift. You are really thinking. You're like, I'm going to take the things that she says because she talks a lot. And I'm going to put it in a, in a permanent form. And then she can stick it wherever she goes. Thank you so much. <laughs> Ask me what happened a little bit a while ago. Okay, I think I opened this because I thought, I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. Amazon. I took it out. I saw the purple and I said, okie dokie. Is it like a, it's a little apron. Rose Lily Cactus Apron. Listen, the amount of aprons I have, you could open up a five-star restaurant. And it's not five stars because we all know how to cook. It's five stars because everyone has five aprons that they could wear. That, oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, it has a pocket. Oh, every apron needs a pocket. Ooh, and it's got the long, the long ties. I could tie it in front. No, I can't. I'm still too big for it. But I could tie it in the back. Oh, sha ba 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 Oh, I thought there was a, a thing in the pocket. Something for you and for Riley. Enjoy your gifts. Love what you do from Rana or Rona. Thank you so much. Riley wishes I would bake him some dog treats. <laughs> Another little note here. This is from Riley, spelled R-I-L-E-I-G-H. You said, put the vowels in there. Put all the vowels in there. From Upland, Upland, California. Do you live downwind? No, I live upland. <laughs> Get it right. You can open on the P.O. Box video. Thank you so much for the permission. I can see perfectly where it is. If I could just... Looks like a little note. Hey, hi, Christine. Wanted to start this off by thinking you have such good handwriting. I say it all the time, but everyone always has such good hand. I mean, the, I, I was there when we took handwriting. No one, no teacher ever corrected me. They said it's a, it might be a lost cause. At least she can read. I want to start this with thank you for everything you do for millions of people you don't even know. Riley, are you going to make me cry? You help so many people every day. You have brightened my life in so many ways from helping get out of the depression episodes to helping me understand my anxiety. You make it so easy to let go and enjoy life. Christine, please don't change you. I hate saying that because I believe change is good. Me too. And a healthy thing. Changing life is good, but changing yourself is not as simple. Keep being yourself. You are amazing. So much, so, so much words of wisdom coming out of you, Riley. You're amazing and so much more inspirational than you may realize. I wish I was better expressing how much I look up to you and how I love your content. You have taken me out of a a very dark place. I was extremely depressed and then I found one day on TikTok showing the new cactus you spontaneously got <laughs> and what to name him. You have such an amazing contagious laugh that you share with the world. I think you are such a creative person and you're the reason I am two years sober. Congratulations! Two years sober! Oh, oh, oh. Two years sober. Congratulations! That's awesome. That's kick-ass. I know this is asking a lot but would you be interested in creating a tattoo design for me? Seeing how you have become such a successful person has inspired me to pursue my dream of becoming a tattoo artist. Holy cow. That sounds fun. Sounds like a fun job. I just started having my own clientele and I'm really doing it. I hope you're doing well, Christine. Oh my God. And you put your Instagram and whatnot. <gasps> you want me to design a tattoo? I mean, I just talked about my awful handwriting, so it won't be any words. <laughs> you want me to design a tattoo? How? Who? Who is the tattoo for? You? You don't want something I designed on your body. No, no, no. It's going to say something like, you asked me about what happened a while ago. I might talk for a living, but you don't want anything that I hand wrote atrocious handwriting. You don't want anything that I say because grammatically the word's not in the right place. I, you know what? I'll think about it. I'll think about it and I'll get back to you and let me just sit on it a minute. You are asking a lot because I don't think my creative juices flow in the area of tattooing. <laughs> you know? Permanent things on your body. This is either a bunch of chapsticks some Lincoln logs, a box of pencil sharpeners, who knows, Amazon, or it's a bunch of jewels. <laughs> Diving gems, pool party favors. Just a bunch of gems in a little box. If I didn't know this from was from Amazon, I would have think you've been sending me on a treasure hunt. You're the blooms, my lady. Well, treasure chest. This will be fun to recreate and use with my nephew. How do you get it open? Oh, it just, oh, it comes out the bottom. I already lost one of them. The little jewels. This would be fun in a pool, really sparkly. You toss them down, go get them. I just like this container itself. A little contraption, a little trap door action. I don't know who it's from, but thank you. <laughs> this is from Amazon. I'm drunk in the back of the car and I'm crying like a baby. What? Is this an American flag? Someone sent me an American flag. They said, are you ready for the 4th of July? Advanced clean floss picks. What a weird combo. The land that I love. Floss your teeth. Floss your gums? Do you floss your teeth or do you floss your gums? When the dentist goes, hey, have you been flossing? They just go, have you been flossing? I should counter. Floss my gums or floss my teeth? Do you floss your gums? I think you floss the teeth. You're flossing in between the teeth and it might touch your gums. I'm not sure. Thank you for these. I just ran out. I don't know how you, I don't know how people know that I just ran out of these. Fourth of July. All of this has reminded me is that we should make a Christine Snaps flag. <laughs> Instead of stars, it's just all the little cups of coffee. <laughs> 
every line is just like all my little sayings put on a line. Who sent that? Thank you. I think it's Amazon, but it came from Beloit, Wisconsin. What is this? Is this a machete? No, it's combs. Do I look like I gotta brush my hair? This big ass box for some combs. Mine snapped in the shower. Did I tell you guys that? I have a comb in the shower and it snapped. You either think my head is big or my hair is thick. Only one of those is correct. I got some thin hair, but big brushes. Thank you so much. It's just a comb, it's a comb. I got three of them. Now I can be snapping them in the shower left or right. Yay, yay, I'm trying to get those tangles out. This feels like a speed round. What? What is this? More hair. Oh, we haven't gotten any hair today. If you look to your left, would that be your left? If you look to your left, we're now entering the hair portion of the P.O. Box video. I see another comb in here. A comb, a hair cap, a little rainbow wig, pride wig. Is this like a little bob? Oh, it's such a small little, this is cute. Wait a damn. <laughs> this is like one of those wigs you're not supposed to be able to see. <laughs> Where are my eyes? This is the front, is it not? I can't even navigate my natural hair. I look like an Oompa Loompa that escaped the factory and said, I'm not living a life of candy no more. I'm going to the raves. Look at that. Oh my, who is she? Who is she? Oh, that's fun. I'm gonna bring that. I just, I can't stop moving my head. I just keep, oh, 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 oh. Every single angle, you're like, oh my, who is she? Who is that? Maybe I should get my hair cut to this length because it's the perfect, like, swiping. If I, the more I do this, the more I'm getting pissed off. What? What? Who drank the last iced coffee? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Can you imagine back in the olden days, they were wearing the white dusty curler wigs and then they just like ran out. We ran out of the white wig, the curler wigs, the people that went to wearing in parliament. All we have left are the rainbow bobs. We're gonna start handing out the rainbow bobs and everyone's just walking around. I'm just out there scooping the horse poo. I'm like, oh my God, it's like a rainbow car wash in my eyes. This is fun. Oh! <laughs> Wigs always make me want to dance. I don't know what. <laughs> if I wore a wig 24 seven, I'd always just be like tapping my foot. They'd be like, ma'am, ma'am, please hold still. We're trying to get your passport for it. I'm like, oh my God, just take the damn photo. I'm having a great time. Thank you, whoever said that. <laughs> Clearly. This feels sturdy. What is this, a belt buckle or a purse? Is that a bow tie? <gasps> Is that for a dog? This is from Rana again. Rona, Rana. Okay, this must have been the dog portion. That is so stinking cute. A little cactus dog bow tie. Oh, I mean, I could wear it too. That really completes the look. I don't know if Riley's got this big of a neck. Look, this is a cactus. This is, this is, that's heavy duty. Unique style paws. Oh, this will fit him. A little dog collar. I mean, he could wear it if I could get my big fat neck around it. Excuse me, I just, I'm, I've got lost on the way to the, to the cactus festival rave in the desert. Did you guys, which way? Did you guys see which way to that is? Could you just wipe in the right direction? Thank you so much. Thank you for that. He's gonna look so cute in that. Dog to chew toy. Well, that'll put Riley to the test. He loves to destroy toys. Cactus chew toy. Look at the packaging. They said, we just shove it in there. That is really sturdy. He might actually, that might be indestructible for him. I have to test it out. Yeah, yeah. Me on the way to the desert festival, but I'm cutting down the trees in the forest. Yeah, yeah. That smells like stinky feet and cotton candy. What a combo. <laughs> Thank you. I'll probably put like an Instagram picture up and a story of Riley wearing the collar. That's so cute. Or the bow tie. Is this? Oh, is this a cactus steering wheel cover? Oh, hell yeah. From Rana, Rona again. Wow, you coming through, Rana. Mine's getting a little dusty, so I might have to wash it. Cactus steering wheel cover. I wish more things in life were like steering wheel sized. You know what I'm talking about? These are so fun. It could be like a big headband. <laughs> That's a cute print though. I'll have to change mine out. I'm gonna have to take this off. I'm sorry. Can I just put this on the counter? There's a lot going on back there. You know, sometimes when like girlfriends are like, I chop, I caught my boyfriend cheating because I found some other girl's hair in his car. Who's got the bleach blonde hair? With the amount of wigs that I've been sent. If I was dating somebody, they'd be like, how many people are coming to your house? And why do they have bad, bad hair hygiene? Why are they shedding so much? I'm finding orange, red, purple, blonde, black. This is a bang length hair follicle. They're everywhere. You'd always be catching me with other people's hair on my body. Fake hair, synthetic hair, wig hair. That'd be a weird problem to have. <laughs> Oh my god, what is this? Dog, oh is this dog treats? For tiny trainers, tender treats? Turkey and pomegranate, look at that. Oh, he'll like how smelly they are, but me? <laughs> I'll stick to the, the, the ketchup uh, chapstick. <laughs> this says it's from AFR Tech Inc. Farmingdale, New York. Farmingdale? Oh, wait, another steering wheel cover? What's going on? 
What's going on? Another steering wheel cover. This one's splatter paint. I wish you could combine a cactus splatter paint steering wheel cover. Maybe I can. Maybe I can take up sewing. I have like a splatter paint one on there now, but it doesn't look like this. Listen, we got three in the rotation. The one I have on there, the cactus and this one. They're in the rotation. I gotta find, maybe I can put this as like a, as like a, a neck rest on top of my office chair. What else is circular? It could go on top of that, like a little headband for the cactus. We'll figure it out. I'm gonna start looking around and be like, what's a circular round thing I could decorate? <laughs> it's from Jenny Ham Lake, Minnesota. Ham Lake? I prefer the cheese pond, but she's from Ham Lake, Minnesota. Jenny. I'm still, I'm still Jenny from the block. Then I had a little, but I had a lot. I live on Ham Lake. Ba -ba 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 -ba. What are they just rolling some dice with words on them? And they're like, whatever lands, that's what we're calling the town. Ham Lake. Name the last thing you ate, the last body of water you're in. You're like, oh, a ham and a bed. It was a lake. Maybe it was a pot, a crick. And they're like, no, Ham Lake. That sounds great. We already made up the bumper stickers, posters, and everyone's got a free doormat coming their way. Oh, it feels like a t-shirt. Oh. Like a Hakuna Matata, and I'm always singing. No joke, the when I no, no, the past week I have been singing the. I can see what's happening, huh? And they don't have a clue. Who? They'll fall in love, and here's the bottom line: a trio's down to two. Oh, oh look, look at that. Hakuna Matata, the Lion King, one of the best. All splatter paint. They got Timon, Boomba, and the little what's a Simba? Nope, that's Simba. What the? F I didn't even know they made this. I've been singing the soundtrack all week. I like Ham Lake. <laughs> oh, here. Oh my God, what's this? Scented room spray and stress relief and a hand sanitizer. All the same scent. She said Bath and Body Works. Who? The trio. The trifecta. Let's see what it smells like. Room spray. Stress relief. Oh, I love stress relief stuff. Eucalyptus and spearmint. She replaced it with the fart spray. That's exactly the thought. I was like, what if it's just silly straight? What if it's a fart spray? Eucalyptus and spearmint. It's supposed to it's supposed to take the stress out of the room. Oh my! It smells like a new car, or a cute man. Just spray that. Uh, smells great. Oh my god! And I got it in a lotion and a hand sanitizer. Oh. I can see what's happening, huh? Christine, that's my name on a card. Look at the little sticker on the back. Okay, I might have sprayed too much. Get a little lightheaded. Might have to end the video soon. <laughs> oh, cute car. Look at that little design. Oh hell yeah! Oh my god. I have this sticker. Okay, Jenny, you and I were on the same wavelength. Hi, Christine, my name is Jenny from Ham Lake, Minnesota. The original name of my town was Glen Carey? Glen Carey? Glen Carey. But it was too hard for the Scandinavian settlers to pronounce, so they called it Ham Lake after our lake that looks like a ham. The lake looks like a ham? What does a ham look like? It's a pretty oblong shape. <laughs> Anyways, how did you know that I was gonna make fun of the town and then also want to know the history? Jenny, you and I, same wavelength. You t we're, we're, yeah. Anyways, I love your humor and your I love your humor and your ideas. You are a creator that I typically put on when I need a laugh after a rough day or need to get my anxiety under control. Your videos are my favorite and ones that I look forward to each week. Thank you for creating and for putting yourself out there. Oh, thank you. I thought this card was unique and the story about the artist on the back was a bonus. I saw that. There's something. I hope you like the shirt. You were singing Hakuna Matata in a video and I saw the splatter paint one and got it. Happy whatever month you open this. <laughs> Happy whatever month you open this. <laughs> this out feels like such a dig. <laughs> Jenny and Dyson must be her cat or her dog. She put a little paw Jenny and Dyson, what a combo. This card, Ethel Kavlehim, was a gifted self-taught artist from Stoughton, Wisconsin, who became key to the American revival of rose mailing, the decorative folk art of Norway that directly translates to rose painting. I love that. Is this one of her designs? That's awesome. I love a little card with a little history on it. People do not utilize the back of the card enough. They just put the little barcode on there and call it a day. Stickers, of course. This one says, aha. Uh -huh. This one says, the writer. I don't know if I ordered this sticker or someone gave me this sticker, but I have this sticker literally hanging on my office wall. Glad to have a backup. This one says, oof. I feel like I say that a lot. Oop. Oh, <gasps> this one kind of looks like Riley as he's throwing his body into the car to go on a coffee run. This one says, just wing it, which is probably now going to go on the cactus tree. Thank you so much. The card, the shirt, the sentiment, the good smells. I love that. We are on a similar wavelength. I appreciate you. Thank you guys. So the notes today. Thank you guys so much for the notes and the honestly, the words of encouragement to me to keep going and keep creating and to keep 
I don't know, to keep doing whatever. I, I think I started the video saying that I've had really bad anxiety lately, so I wanted to do a video that I feel like in a space that I feel comfortable in. You know, I always want to encourage people to, you know, you battle your depression, and a lot of people live with anxiety, but it's not things that we can let overtake our life. You have to keep fighting for it, keep finding things that make you laugh and make you feel comfortable and make you feel in a safe space. That doesn't have to be my videos or me. I never thought that that's what I was doing when I make videos. Um, <laughs> I'm literally just talking, things that come to mind. I really appreciate all the nice words, and I'm rooting for everybody and I'm hoping you guys are having good days and good weeks and good lives. It's crazy that people are like, you know, you like helps millions of people or like you, you know, people like your videos and I, oh, it just feels good. And I, I hope you guys feel good. And if this video is a distraction for you or helps you make your day a little bit better, I mean, what else could I really ask for? You know, that's crazy. Thank you guys so much. You gonna wait until the last 30 seconds to cry? You little baby, you little baby. Now I have an accent. I the brain, I'm, I'm winding down. I'm so hungry and I'm sweating. In the room, I think, you know what? I think that I think that spray's getting to me. It took all the stress out of my body and filled me in with emotion. I'm gonna stand outside, get some fresh air. Oh, look at my, look, look. Take care of yourself. I live by that, okay? Bye.